Well, good, wonderful, beautiful morning, buddies. Oh my goodness. What are we doing today? What are we doing today? We're going to work on cleaning the house a little bit. It's still too warm to go. If we would have went earlier, but it was raining. It's actually mid-afternoon right now. When we woke up this morning, it was pouring rain. So we couldn't go for our morning W-A-L-K. We couldn't go for the W-A-L-K because it was raining. So you girls will be good for a little bit. I got to run to the post office and uh, we're going to go check out the fire. So we came back downtown to see what was left of the building. I mean, we kind of saw yesterday that they knocked it down or it fell down and then they continued to knock it down. But we're going to go see what it looks like now. So I came back downtown to see and they have pretty much torn the whole building down. It is the next day and you can see they are still spraying water on everything. I think they're still just trying to kill any of the hot spots that may be there. And also the dust and everything else. These poor firemen have worked all night. It's just crazy. It's just crazy. There you can see, that's it. That's all that's left. That brick wall saved the theater and those firemen working so hard to keep everything wet there. Definitely saved the theater building, but it's gone. That's so crazy. So I don't know how well you can hear me because that truck is still running, but you can kind of see. And then over here, you can see one of the radiators. So there was apartments, I believe, above that one. And then this is the Thunder Bay Theater building, and you can see this window was blown out. But it does look like they really saved the theater. You can see the ash and the soot up at the top. But the theater looks to be saved, which is amazing. It's a miracle. This room here was called the Antler Room. You could rent it out for private parties. That seemed to hold up pretty well, but everything else is definitely gone. Yeah, I don't know how they did it, but they managed to save the theater, which is just it's mind blowing. It has been crazy to see so many people posting on Facebook about their memories of JJ's and how long it's been there and Agnes the ghost. If you guys don't know, we talked about it a little bit, I think on the CC Mouse podcast. I think I don't even remember at this point but the place was haunted it had been on many different TV shows for like paranormal activity and ghosts and things like that there was a ghost that lived upstairs named Agnes and Agnes was actually the wife of John A. Lau who started the saloon it was named John A. Lau's saloon it was crazy I actually worked there for two days <laughs> way back oh gosh it was years ago right out of Oh, maybe 1999 I worked there. I worked there for two days. I did not like the boss at the time. So after two days, I decided I don't want to work for these people and I quit. But I did work there for two days, two whole days. I never experienced any of the ghostly stuff that some of the other waitresses they had said they experienced. But it was really cool. It had like a little outdoor eatery that was like walled in. So it was like, it reminded me of like a Hollywood set. You walked out a little door and there was all these like fake little buildings and tables outside so you could sit outside but it was walled in by all these buildings around it and then they had like fake little building fronts on it i don't know it was really cool it was a really neat place and now it's uh it's it's gone it's gone but they saved thunder bay theater wow what the heck is going on 2020 what it's a little bit earlier than we normally go, but it's nice and cool out there. It's like 6.30. Do you wanna go for a walk before we eat dinner? Normally we go after dinner, but do you wanna go before we eat dinner? Let's see, are you hungry or do you wanna go for a walk? Both? Yeah? Yeah? What? Come here and tell me. How am I gonna know? Tell me. Wanna go for a walk? Wanna go for a walk? Tell me. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. She loves that freaking beanbag chair being right in the window. You love it, don't you? You love it. All right, we're gonna take these girls for a walk because it's nice out. We're gonna go do that. 
Oh my goodness, are we back from our walk? Are we making some salad for dinner? Are you waiting for a piece? Look at this giant piece of spinach. A wee piece of spinach for you. Do you actually like it? <laughs> Do either of you like it? It's good for you, you want more? One more big piece? Oh man. Good stuff, one more big piece. She's like, I'm not sure how I feel about spinach, guys. You like it though, don't you? Yeah, you like everything. Oh, look at that big stretch. Look at you. Oh, I know, you just want to go out again. That's all you ever want is back out. Out, 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 out. <laughs> what do you think? Think we should let your sister out for the seven millionth time today? Think we should let her outside? Would you like to go back outside? I know you want to. Do, but move your butt. Do you want to go back outside? Today was a little bit shorter of a vlog. This is actually the next day that I'm recording this, but uh, we're just gonna go ahead and put it up. Sometimes, you know, things are a little bit, days are a little bit shorter, not as much happens, but you guys seem to like it when we upload regularly, so we're gonna try to keep doing that. And, really? And that, that's part of what this is. Do you love this bed? Do you love it? Some of you have been asking me where I got this. Um, it actually got sent to us. I didn't order it. I don't know how it ended up getting sent to us, but it did. And uh, the reality of it is, is they're not really great beds. The f the fluffiness factor just isn't there. Like, they're very... <laughs> Kira's like, that's okay. What if I do this? Are you a cat? Oh my gosh. What happened? Are you like a cat? Oh my gosh. You are like a cat, aren't you? You're goofy. <laughs> You're silly. Are you a cat? Because I'm a cat. I'm like a cat. Are you going to get it? <laughs> yeah? Is that what you think? Anyway, yeah, we uh, we got sent two of these. I think they wanted us to review them, but uh, they're not, they're not very, they're not, I don't know how to explain it. They're very not fluffy. They look like they should be fluffy and the outside of this should be like kind of stiffer and the middle should be fluffy and they're just not. I mean, Kira likes it, but I think she likes it because it's not a super hot bed. You can see... My hand just goes straight to the ground here, and you can see there's like a weird lump here, and we have fluffed it and fluffed it, and the dogs have fluffed it, and it's just not fluffy and then. Just not fluffy and then, 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 then. But you, th you do think you're a cat, don't you? I'm, wait, I'll do it again. Here, I'll do it again. <laughs> you are silly. Uh, all right, you guys, we're going to go ahead and end today's vlog. We will be back on Monday with another one. We hope you guys enjoyed today's video. As always, thanks so much for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Stay positive, dream big, and we will see you again soon. Boop. Goodbye, guys. Good night, audience. <laughs> Memphis is like, this silly puppy. Oh, I see that tail. So it goes, this silly, this silly puppy. No, is it that you want? You got stuff in your eyes. Hold on, let me get it. Oh, go. Because this silly puppy. I remember when you was a silly puppy. She says, yeah, I'm too old for that puppy stuff now. Too old for that puppy stuff. Once in a while, we still get you going, don't we? You're a more mature lady now. More mature. Okay, goodbye, guys. If you love our huskies, come along for the ride. All you have to do is hit subscribe. Follow as we share our lives with our dogs And join our adventures on Snow Dog Vlogs